we wait for the red light to change, which it does not do yet. It does now, and we go green, and the field sprinting down towards so one. It's a very good start from Van Zwaan Beltoise, and it is swooping through in second place, Gail Castelli, and immediately Jan Zimmer. Well, all sorts of jostling going on behind, and it is Mateo Herrera has to defend and up the inside. Antoine Miguel, brilliant manoeuvre. They all then close up on the brakes. Have they given each other enough room? As Miguel, a little bit maybe tentative on the brakes, gets barged. Eaton, who looks the inside into turn one. Again, not an awful lot of room. Everybody slithers out wide. It's the inside, and he clatters into the side. Of it. Oh, and contact, and that's why. Because he got absolutely clouted by Mateo Herrero. Right with him, and the fight for the lead suddenly comes alive as we hit half-race distance. And Gail Castelli asking all the questions all of a sudden. Run down towards the quick right-hander at turn 11. A flash... Looking to the inside of the sax curve for Castelli. Again, it's another corner. Has Zimmer over committed Guillaume? He gets the power down and squirts away a little bit quicker. May be able to move through, and that appears to be what's happened because they're side by side. The head towards turn seven. And Mark Gio swoops past Jan Zimmer, or does he? Zimmer takes to the curbs. He keeps his foot in. Turn now. The checker flag is ready and waiting. It's going to be victory in the opening race of the Alpine Elf Europa Cup here in Hockenheim for Jean Baptiste Mailer, runner up Gail Castelli.